Hello everyone, I'm Eric Shamoris, and welcome back to Burnout Paradise! More specifically, Quest to 100%, Burnout Paradise, Bikes! Although I'm not really on a bike right now, but that'll change in like, five seconds. Basically, I finished Minecraft, and kind of, I wasn't sure what I wanted to do. Like, whether I wanted to do just, like, random videos, or what. Ooh. I should take the one with more strength, <laughs> less speed. That'll probably work better for me. But I wasn't sure what I wanted to do. But then I decided I'll do the Burnout Bikes DLC. Why not? It shouldn't take too long. And I, I figured I'd do it now rather than waiting, rather than waiting, uh, you know, however many months it takes me for e to either finish Sonic Adventure or Daggerfall. You now own the Burnout Paradise motorbikes. I already did. These bikes are made for speed and we've set up a new collection of events. Check the map and your new license for details on your progress. Win events to build to 100% and we will give you some new rides. If you're new to Paradise City, you may want to spend some time in your car getting... No, I already did. I 100% I of the city. I think I know the city well enough. Uh, female rider, male rider. Well, I'm a male, so I'll go with male. Metallic. Prolescent. Obviously. Oh, done. Purple and pink. Sure. Um, it should go much faster because... It's so weird. Because a lot of the... I don't know how to change between day and night. I don't know if I can. Uh, because basically, bike zone, 2 out of 4. Day roads ruled, 0 out of 64. I don't know how to change between day and night. I don't know if I can. Uh, but, uh, Night Roads, Burning Rides, Midnight Rides, Free Burn Challenges, well, Free Burn Challenges I'm not gonna get, those are online. Uh, I mean, I will eventually at some point, but, see, I don't know, because I have the offline time night, but yeah, most of it's just speed. I'm gonna check the map, just uh, to check, uh, I could do some Midnight Rides, but first I just want to see if I can control this at night. See, I kind of want to do this at day first, though, because the nighttime ones are blot. At least it doesn't show that. I was curious about that, whether it actually showed me crashing. Uh, it didn't. Uh, which is kind of good, because that would have ended badly. Uh, very badly. I didn't know whether it was going to be, like, a midnight run. You could get the bikes. Midnight Run 2, I'm thinking of. Where you could get bikes at the one point, and... Uh... They... You just went flying. If you, uh... Crashed off of those. Uh, what is the handbrake? Is there a handbrake? There's a... What is that? What is a Paradise Reward? I don't... I... I really... I... I... I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm just gonna ignore the fact that stuff happened. And, uh... Get more road rules during... Right near the essence of Matt. Um, I will do races at some point. But that's the thing that's gonna really make this not take long. The fact that there's no collection. I don't have to drive around trying to find things. I know where things are. I just don't know how the day-night cycle works. I wrecked, but my guy wasn't there. Uh, that's probably for the best. License. Let's see. I hit A. I don't think that brings me to license. I think that brought me to the news. Yeah. Uh, Paradise Awards. I really did it. Nightcrawler. Played your first night road roll. Oh, so I'll do these too. It seems like. Uh, well, I probably will have to do these. I guess those are in place of the of any achievements, because there's no achievements for the Bikes DLC, so I guess they did those in place of the achievements. Unless those were there for the cars, too. I don't remember seeing them for the cars. Because I, I think they just had the achievements for the cars. I'm getting, actually, a pretty decent amount of these. At least the crashing takes less time. So if I screw up... Ah, oh, crap. See, I don't know, because there's the midnight, the burning rides and the midnight rides i don't know whether this one's gonna be tough i'm gonna need the speed speed one for the I, see i should just get the speed one because the strength isn't helping me one bit 
Uh, but the thing is, I don't know whether I'm actually going to... Yeah, I'm going to go back and then go onto the highway and do that midnight ride there. I just want to check. Is there a way? I don't need store. Not yet. Time of day. Time settings. 40 minute, 48 minute. Constant time of day. Time is always midday. That works. Now I got all the day ones. Because the day ones are easier. The day ones are less time, if I remember correctly. So that'll be a lot easier. I'll get through all the day ones and then I'll switch tonight. Plus, it's easier to see during the day. Okay, remember how I said they'd be easier? I lied. Because this is still me playing. How much percent am I at? Just cur I'm at zero. Never mind. I thought it was go a lot. I thought, oh, it's gonna be going a lot faster because, you know, it's less stuff to do. But then again, I only did four road rules so far. So, uh, I should probably do some races. Those would probably be what what, uh, really boosts me. Although, I'm gonna have to sit through this. Hopefully, it doesn't take long for them to load. Like it does with the cars. How it, they have to drop from the sky and all that stuff. That didn't take as long. Ooh, fancy. I don't know why I think that's fancy. Purple. Obviously. Gotta go with purple. Purple is... That sounded weird. Holy crap! I think it was just because I was, like, going slow. It... So, is there no handbrake? A was boost in the cars. What was handbrake? Was there a handbrake? There definitely was a handbrake. I know that much. But what was the button? I don't want to be on 7th Street. I'm going to do East Crawford, hopefully West Crawford then. The road rules. And then I'll go do a race. Or a burning ride. I don't know whether they're actual races or whether they're more like burning roots. I'm highly guessing they're more like burning roots. Judging by the names. That sucked. This is not gonna go well. I'm just gonna go do the burning ride down here. These can't turn for crap. Oh my god, this is gonna be so much tougher than I thought. I thought this was gonna be like, oh, I'm just gonna go through, dominate everything, and then just win. But then that happened multiple times. No DJ Atomica. Oh. I got my hopes up. So yeah, it's gonna be all time-based. Which... is good and bad. Good in the sense that I don't have to do, like, road rages, which I knew I wasn't gonna have to, but... I don't have to worry about, like, dealing with people too much. But bad in the sense that... Um... That I still do that a lot. So it's gonna... It's gonna take me a bit to get used to all this. It's gonna take me a bit to get used to the bikes, because they control so much differently than any of the cars. Like, even the worst handling cars... Like... It seems like even the worst handling cars handle better than this. But then again, you have a little more leeway with crashes when you're on cars. You, obviously, you don't have leeway with crashes on bikes. That would make no sense, to be completely honest. But uh, it, it's gonna take some time getting used to the uh, getting used to the handling. I'm really hoping, like I was hoping that this would take less than ten episodes. But by the time I get used to the handling, who knows? And I'm not editing these. I'm not gonna edit these like I did, unless I get to a race or something where it's like it, it takes me like 50 tries to get through it. Then I'll obviously edit it down. But I mean, it's gonna take a lot longer than I thought. It sh still shouldn't take too long. It's not gonna take no nine months like the freaking... I think it was nine months, eight months, who cares. But it's not gonna take that long. Especially since I just want a race or a burning ride. My time, 131. 2% complete! Shit. Never mind, this might go fast. Might go a lot faster than I thought. I mean, there's only... 40 rides and then a bunch of ro road rules like if I can start knocking out a bunch of road rules do 
Uh, let's see. I'll do an amount. I'm trying to think. I don't want to go to what I was doing with Burnout uh, with the 100% where I was doing like, oh, I'll do this much percent per episode. God damn it. I don't know how I crashed there. I was one of those, like, barely crashes. But I don't want to do what I was doing with uh, the main game where toward the end, mostly because progress was slow, I started doing the, oh, I'm going to get 2% per episode. Like, I don't want to say, oh, I'm going to get 10% per episode because then... I'll, even if I hit the 30 minute mark and I don't want to edit and stuff, I'll feel like I have to edit it down because I it took me like 45 minutes or whatever to beat the because it took me 45 minutes or whatever to beat the uh, thing to be to get to 10%. So I'm not going to do that. I mean, obviously I want to get 10% completion per episode if possible but if stuff like that keeps happening it's not going to plus to get 10% I would have to do about four four uh the burning rides and 128 so I would need to do about 12 or 13 of these so uh yeah it's possible. I will say that. I've been doing this for a while already, though. I mean, it's take it's gonna take a lot longer to get me to get progress toward the beginning, not because... not because it's more difficult to get progress, but just because I'm not used to this. I'm not used to the driving. I'm not used to how any of this controls. And I'm just... I, and I'm just gonna keep going, because I keep starting new road rules, so why not? I'm just gonna drive. That's basically what a lot of this is gonna be. Just me driving around the city quickly. That's just how it's gonna go because uh, that's pretty much what this is going to be. That's also kind of why I want this to not go 10 episodes because, I mean, the main game, I felt like it started getting fairly repetitive toward the end. Me doing races and then doing this and that and the. You know, it started getting very repetitive toward the end. This, I think, if I if it goes way too long, it's going to get really repetitive. Just because it's all speed challenges, it's all road rules and burning routes, basically. So, if this goes on for too long, it's going to get really repetitive. Because it's just going to be, oh, hey, let I drove here fast last episode. Let me drive here fast this episode. So... I mean, it's still gonna, I'm still gonna have a ton of fun, and I have a feeling once I get new bikes, I don't know, the way it sounded, you get the bikes after you beat it 100%, which I don't know if that's true. Maybe you get them, um, maybe you get one after you beat it 100% and one after you beat it like 50%. Who knows? Uh, well, I know who knows, probably someone who's uh, beaten this 100% already, but I don't know where I was going with that statement. I don't know, I'm focused on the racing, I'm focused on the speed that I, I, I'm, I'm not paying attention to talking. Not even a bit. But, um, yeah, I think this should still be fun, as long as it doesn't go, uh, like, way too long. Which, I mean, ten episodes, that's about two and a half months worth of episodes, that's not bad. That, that's not bad for a series. Especially considering the uh, other series went... <gasps> oh no, I just cancelled that one. I forgot that the South Mountain Drive curves. Uh, well, I'm doing South Bay Expressway. And then I'll do a burning route. Burn burning... What was it? A burning ride. That's it. I'll do that after this. Oh, and I hit South Ross Drive where I kind of started this whole thing. Uh, I think it would be interesting to have like stunt runs in that <laughs> on the bikes. It would have been really interesting, but again, it was like a free DLC, so I assume they didn't spend too much time on it. They were like, oh yeah, let's uh, make it speed-based, because obviously you can't have crashes and stuff on a bike. Well, you could. Uh, I don't think you really want to. Because that'll happen. You'll just black out and then reappear on your bike. That's not actually what happens when you crash. Don't go out and try that, anyone. 
Not that I think anyone would actually go out and try that. If you do, then, uh... Well, maybe you deserve to get hurt. Because if you're that stupid that you'd actually try that. I'm gonna shut up now and, uh, Burning Ride. Or not, because I, uh, went out of the thing. Burning Ride! 15 minutes I've been recording. Uh, I can do a decent amount of these. I won't get 10%, I don't think, but I could get, like, 8%-ish. If it goes 12 episodes, three months, that's not bad for a series. Especially considering, uh, I've done... I've done a lot worse already. I've done triple that for basically every series that I started when I started this channel. And, uh... Actually, it would have been longer if, for like... A m month or two, I wasn't doing, like, so many videos. Ah, oh, I... I'm used to the crashes taking a lot longer, so I went to you know, scratch my head and t suddenly I was back on my bike. Immediately. I don't know whether the, uh, burning rate, the burning raids, yeah, that's what I was talking about. The burning roots, rides, it's, it's gonna take so much getting used to. I don't know whether the burning rides are, like, I don't know whether they are gonna get harder. I don't know whether, they're... don't look backwards! What are you doing? Stupid, keep your eyes on the road. I'm a bad enough driver, so as it is. I don't need you not looking at the road. Although as long as I'm looking at the road, it shouldn't matter, but shut up. I don't care about video game logic, I'm using real logic. I don't know why. I don't know what I'm talking about either. I got a, I got a thing. I've won, woo. Uh, what percent? It's kind of nice that it shows the percent on the license now since it doesn't need to show how many races and stuff. 5%! So that is... Ac I'm actually making pretty good progress. I've only been recording for about 17 minutes, and already at 5%? That's not bad. Uh, what is 100 divided by 12? It's not even, I know that, but it's like 8%? 8... Uh, that's 96, so... If I get like 8 or 9% per episode, I could get... I could get this done in 12 episodes. Get this done in three months, I could do it. Actually, it might be less than three months because since I'm moving, which I mentioned, I, I realized I didn't actually mention in this episode, in, in this video. I mentioned it in my Sonic video that went up Friday. Yeah, it's going up Friday. But, um... Or it went up Friday. But I, I don't know. I... I'm recording these in the past, and I'm talking about the future. I don't know what I'm talking about. But, uh... I mentioned in my Sonic video, I'm moving. Like, by the time this video comes out, I would have already, I would already be moved. But, since I'm living closer to work, and the commute will be cut down from an hour and a half now to 15 minutes, that's like an extra two and a half hours in a day every day that I should have to be able to do videos and such. So, it's a very good possibility that I might be able to go back up to like five videos a week. I started doing four videos a week, which I'm really happy about. Like, I've been able to get out four videos a week, somehow. Despite the fact that, you know, the hour and a half commute and working a full-time job. Full, full-time job. Yes, I just, I just, just, sit at a desk playing with wind chimes all die almost got killed right there i was trying to make a stupid joke that wasn't going to be funny whatsoever and almost died because of it or i or i died because of my awful driving well actually it wasn't my awful driving it was well i was uh kind of uh crossing an intersection that i probably shouldn't have been without looking both ways and the light was probably red if there was a light or the stop sign was probably uh said stop. I don't know what I'm talking about. How can you guys listen to me? Half the time, I don't even know what I'm talking about. How do any of you know what I'm talking about? But, um, I really don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just, I'm just, because this is one of those games where I, like, kind of have to focus, so half the time I just, like, go off on tangents and just not even paying attention to what I'm saying. I probably went off camera there. You are here. Did I? 
Can't tell. Does it matter? Not really. I'm just stalling for time while DJ Atomica tells me what I'm doing. Crystal Summit? That's over a direction. Um, 2 minutes 56, 56, oh, 7.6 miles. That is beautiful. Uh, pause is not the button that I wanted. I wanted this one. Just because, uh, I don't want to, if I crash that early, it's not a big deal. Uh, 3 minutes, so a minute and a half for about 4 miles. Wait, that says 5. It's not 5, I don't think, unless it changed. Oh, it is 5. Why did it say 7.6? Did it say 7.6, or was that just my eyes playing tricks on me? Uh, well, it's 5 miles then. 3 minutes, about. So, 2.5 in a, a minute and a half. 2.5 miles in a minute and a half. Is that doable? I don't know. I don't have any, that's the other thing, I don't have any sense of how fast these bikes are going, really. Like, I'm, I'm used, like, I got used to seeing the time and going, oh, that's gonna be easy, oh, that's gonna be difficult, based on what car I was driving and that. But, I don't know with these. Like, I don't know how well I can do. That, that's basically how, how I can put it. I don't know. Well, the fact that I'm almost two and a half miles after a minute uh, says good things. It also says good things that I haven't crashed yet. I probably jinxed that, but ooh, yep, I did. <laughs> I like the quick starts, though. When it doesn't say wrecked, it just, uh, I guess that's the equivalent of a drive away. Except, uh, pretty much no accident on, the bike, on a bike like this is going to be a drive away. Especially going that fast. That's, uh, not pleasant. Now I feel like playing Midnight Club 2 because I mentioned that toward the beginning of the episode. I do have that. Don't I? Possibly. I don't know, I can't check. I packed up all my games except for the Xbox games because I figured I'm not going to be playing any PlayStation 2 or anything over the next two days. So I packed them up. And now they're all packed away and I can't check whether or not I have Midnight Club 2. I'm pretty sure I do. I don't see why I wouldn't. I have had it. I have a minute left to get 0.3 miles, and I've crashed twice. But they were like the drive-away crashes, so... This... I, I have a feeling they're gonna get a lot harder. I know they get harder at night. But I have a feeling they're gonna get a lot harder, um... Just period, like... Sort of how the road rules and stuff got harder as I went on. Like, as I did more of them, you know, the amount of... Uh, wrecks, the amount of, uh takedowns that I needed went up so I'm assuming that's what's gonna happen here I'm assuming that at some point I'm going to like like it's gonna just become so unbelievably difficult how many I have holy crap I have 16 roads ruled I mean, I, I mean, I know I was getting a lot of the short, simple ones, but I did not think I had... Whoop. That was bad. I did not think I had that many. 16 roads out of 128. That is a percent. I can math. I can, just not while I'm trying to focus on driving. Don't know what I'm doing since I'm just driving. It seems like I'm just driving aimlessly, which half the time I am. But uh, I'm trying to get to here so I can do this. Not here, it's further down. South Mountain Drive. Uh, so I can actually go the right way and get the road. And then I want to do one more burning ride. I have enough time. I didn't think I would, but I have enough time uh, to do one more burning ride just so I can get those. And I, the reason I, I think the reason I doesn't look like I'm gonna get 10% is because it's factoring in how many bikes I have, which is kind of stupid because if the bikes come from the percent, then it shouldn't really count toward the percent how many bikes I have. But uh, who am I to judge? Uh, I, I guess the developers. I guess that's who I'd be judging. 
So you know what? I am judging you. Not really. Because, uh, I don't know what I'm talking about, but... Besides that... What was I talking about? I'm doing Southbound Drive. How much is this? A minute and a half. I don't remember how far this goes. I don't remember how far South Mountain Drive goes up. I know it goes past the quarry. Only because I'm on the road and I don't see it ending before the quarry. So I know it goes past the quarry. Uh, and I think I saw Burning Road up here. Or Burning Ride. I'm not going to get that right. Ever. Oh! This ends right at the Burning Ride, I think. I think that... Yep. Awesome. I did not see that car. I did not see that car one bit. So the burning ride, I should be able to do. See, the thing is, I, I'm used to like just holding these and then the car stopping. You are here. It doesn't. Race northwest to the wind farm. Oh, I can do that. Maybe. We'll see. Won't we? 2.7 miles in 1.45. That actually might be difficult. Potentially. Or it could be really easy, and I'm just thinking it's going to be difficult. Who knows? We'll find out in about a minute. But uh, then I'll have four of these done, and way more road rules than I ever thought I would have done. Done. I don't think I need to do the... I, I'm pretty sure, for the 100%, I don't need to do the uh, other, th other stuff. The, uh, whatever they're called. On the... <sighs> crap. The... Challenges, the free burn challenges. I think those bring me up to like 101, 102%. Like the cars ones do. The cars ones do that too. If you finish enough of them, you get 100%, and then if you finish all of them, you get, end up with like 102%. Which I think that's what these do. I'll have to check that because otherwise, this might be a quest to like 96%. <laughs> Just because finding someone that I want. But finding s people that, like, I don't know if there's just random people online that actually have the bikes DLC and still play it online. Oh, I've hit 10%. I hit my goal. Without even trying. I'm gonna do, like, one or two more of these. Just because I, uh, didn't hit 30 minutes yet. So, I'm just, I'll use some of that time. Uh, but yeah, this is actually really fun. Like, I didn't really know what to expect, because I couldn't remember... I know I read what was in this, but I couldn't remember whether there were, uh... Races or anything like that. I, I thought it was just speed stuff. But I wasn't 100% on that. So basically, I'm taking my mortal enemy and doing a quest to 100% based solely around that. Because, uh... Speed has never been my friend. I mean, look at that. I was barely going anywhere and still somehow managed to crash. Uh, I think there's one more down here that I can do quick. And then I will end this episode here. Well, get it or not, I'm going to end the episode. I just want to get some of these extra ones done. I just want to get some extra ones done just because then that's less that I have to do later. Lucas Way. This is not the road I was going for. I thought it was going for the... Uh, uh, Shambert Pass, or whatever it's called. Something Pass. It starts with an S-C-H, possibly. Shembri Pass. I was not as far off as I thought- I fucked that up. So anyway, I'm going to end this episode here. Uh, anything else I need to say? Not that I can think of, so thanks for watching. See you next time.